Ministry of Tourism discusses their efforts towards reducing the impact of the COVID-19 outbreak on the industry. The period where we are right now, normally you look at about a 70 to 80 percent occupancy because this is actually still part of the high season for India. And uh, ever since the coronavirus really broke uh, out as a global pandemic, the bookings have come down to 20 percent. And after our talks with the industry, it seems that the situation is only going to worsen and it might actually come down to even 10 percent. The first thing that we started doing was to making sure that the tourists who are in India, the foreign tourists are taken care of because nobody really knew the protocol, no one really knew what to do with it at the state government levels also. So the first thing that we started doing was to educating our tourists, state governments, tour operators, stakeholders that let's make sure that the tourists who are in India are taken care of to the best of our ability. The industry is largely looking for interventions which can leave some cash uh, available with them because as I have already indicated, uh, they need cash to really work, right? They need working capital. So they are looking for interventions either from the banking sector in terms of easing out of uh, the norms or they would be looking for support from uh, reduced taxes. So those are the broad uh, things that would leave money in the hands of the industry as of now. The Honourable Minister has already also met all the association representatives and uh, we are uh, representing the concerns of the industry before the Finance Minister and we hope that very soon uh, some package, an interim package perhaps, shall be announced uh, hopefully. Our immediate concern uh, which we are sharing with the various uh, organizations and institutions is that uh, to minimize the economic impact, to make sure the businesses, uh, I wouldn't say run as usual, but continue to run and that they do not result in job losses.